Ours was a struggle for a non-racial, non-sexist, democratic South Africa. From now, we're moving forward. From now, we are moving forward. It was very, very difficult. We were so divided. All of us recognized that there was a need to do something. Enough is enough and no more. You either succumb or you fight back. We were prepared to see the most incredible race war erupt. I was 51 years when I voted for the first time in my life. I never thought I'd come out. But one day, first I saw Mandela, we could go home. The whole world just came to a standstill. We didn't even know we were crying. I thought, dear God, it's actually happening. A new day was dawning. I felt so humbled to be part of such bravery. It's really 10% what happens to you and 90% how you react to it. We have a simple choice, to either be part of the problem or part of the solution. Life is not about the self, it's about the whole. HIV positive, but it's not the end of my life. As a human being, I am concerned with injustice all over the world. It's a voyage of discovery. It's being alive. We're all in the same boat. If one sinks, the other one sinks. We need each other. Today, I'm happy to be a free black African woman. <laughs> Yes, there is a lot of evil in the world, but there is also a lot of good. In fact, we are made for goodness, which is fantastic. <laughs>